Oh, yeah. I'm not a quitter. <laughs> and thank God for that. Maybe it's the football player in him, but Mike Martin doesn't give up. And all those years of hard work have paid off. Look at all those pies. Mike's pies. He's outgrown this manufacturing facility and planning another move. It wasn't always like this. The first eight years were tough. There was that pie shop in South Tampa. Four flavors, cherry, apple, pecan, and pumpkin. Guys, I know now, pumpkin only sells in October, November, December. You can't give it away any other time, but I was, it was on the menu. So right now you may be asking, how did this former football player get into the pie business? Well, it was because of his mother's cherry pie. He got tired of waiting for her to make it. A single 27-year-old living on the beach in Clearwater is making pies. But I was just making them for myself because I wanted to eat them whenever I wanted to. And there was no doubt that Mike's pies were good. He just needed a way to sell them. It was when Mike got into a food show that everything came together. Welcome to big business. Now, what are your item codes? What's that? Oh, those letters and numbers. He figured it out quickly. And then our item codes start with CLM, which is our kids' first initials, Cam, Luke, Maddie. At this point, we should tell you that Mike Martin's wife is a certain former TV news anchor in town, Gail Searins. One of the best and one of the nicest, too. And all of this is a family operation. The kids, nephews, kids of employees, family friends. That's Mike's Pies. If you look on the wall, it says it's built by the grace of God. It's, it's an actual fact. And it's working. Mike's Pies is in 48 states and the Caribbean. A lot of it, restaurants. 65 flavors and more to come. This is, this is cookies and cream? Yep, cheesecake. cookies and cream cheesecake. Oh, that's good. When will I be able to buy this? There's only two of them. <laughs> <laughs> so it's a, ways, it's a ways off? Yeah, it's going to be a while. 